Hello, this is Mr. Chabry. I've actually put Quilava on the team. I was thinking about it, and you know, I would like to just stick Quilava on here just so I can use it for a little bit. I think that would actually be pretty neat. I'm coming up with a team that is a Kitakami team. Pokemon that either I was unable to use before or, you know, Pokemon that might lead to some good things. So we're going to step up this stairs so we can find the next sign and the, uh, the dangerous den or what was it, what it was called. I forgot what it was called. You can see up here the, the dreaded den. There we go. There is a uh, timber up here. And if you've been watching my... Uh, Gen 5 playthrough. We ha we face quite a few timbers. No, that's actually going on at the same time as I'm doing this portion of the playthrough. So, whether you like newer Pokemon games or older Pokemon games, this is the channel for you. Anyway, let's go up here and grab some items. There is a Pichu there. I'm not worried about Pichu at all. Pichu is not a threat, but... Fire Fang's pretty good. And the mountains. What do you got to say about the mountains, lady? From the mountains, you can only do two things. I guess hiking and battling, I guess, is what she's uh, alluding to. Anyway, Sandshrew comes out. This is an Alolan Sandshrew. So ice and steel. Um, I do want to switch. Just because... Krakatoa is a little bit under leveled, um, I, and that was by that was purposely done because the uh, Typhlosion I've been using for breeding I have it at level 100, but you know, I don't want to bring a level 100 here. I want to bring a Pokemon that I can you know level up into where it needs to be. And I think Krakatoa gives me that, um, and then it being under leveled will make it where it's more of a challenge. Vulpix is out. This is an Alolan Vulpix. So we're going to go ahead and Earth Power it. So we've seen Cantonians out here. And now we're seeing Alolans. Freeze Dry is actually pretty bad for us because of the interaction that move has on um, water-type Pokemon. It's an interesting move. It really is. Uh, but we're going to go ahead and switch out back into Krakatoa. I think Krakatoa could handle uh, Freeze Dry. Yeah. I'm wondering if Ember will do the job. Mist is not a problem for me. And Ember? Will you do... Oh, you need one more Ember. Hopefully you don't have anything that can do much to me. You missed the Blizzard. If Krakatoa gets this, yeah, Krakatoa here, doing good work, good work. Level 35, wants to learn Flame Charge, I'm okay with that. Get a speed boost, get rid of Leer. They've added some moves to this thing that actually makes it interesting to use. Now we'll continue our ascent into the mountains. And I think I think just just a few. Um, let's see, just a few things, so I can boost this thing, boost its special attack and its speed, and then there should be some experience candy. Yeah. Let's get this thing um, leveled up to level 40. Actually, let's level up to... Um, what should we level this thing up to before we let it evolve? I want to get it to level 60. We'll throw 20 candy to it. Yeah, Lava Plume's good. Get rid of Ember.
No, flamethrower's better. Yeah, just get rid of tackle. And I think just since we haven't seen that many of fully evolved Pokemon so far, we're just going to keep it as Krakatoa right now. And yeah, we'll go ahead and use a full restore on our, not you, you. Okay. I think we're good. There's some Noibats up here. A lot of things up here. So we'll land it. There's, yeah, we're going to go ahead and jump across this. There we go. Nice. Grab this item. Grab that item. Do we go into the waterfall? I wonder if that's what we're meant to do here. No, I don't look like we are meant to. But I think we can climb up here to get to the dreaded den. Fly. There's got to be a, like a path to ascend. I guess you have to actually go up the mountain rather than climb directly attached to the wall. I guess that's what we're learning here. Get a Paralyze Heal. Get a Super Potion. I think we're good. I think we just continue the climb. Ooh, I'm glad I jumped up here. Super Fang. That's good for if you've got a mouse or something. I don't know. Super Fang's one of those moves that does fixed amount of damage. It always does half the HP. Um, and that's actually good if you've got, like, say, a defensive Pokemon, maybe. Maybe a Pokemon that's meant to just help you catch things. It's actually really cool. Um, it's not going to do much for us in an actual playthrough team, but... You know, just having that there will come in handy in certain times. There's a bunch of Noibat fur. An elixir. What was that? So land it. Now where do I go? I go this direction now. There's so many Noibats. There's Timbers. Don't mind me, I'm just passing through. Just picking up things that I find along the way. Looking here, there's a Graveler, a Psychic-type Graveler. No, thank you. Don't think I will fight that. There's like a fork in the road. I want to go into the dreaded... Let's see, Infernal Pass, the dreaded den. Do not... We're going this way first. Because I want to see the ogre. I want to see the Shrek. Oni's Maw. There is a Graveler that is sparkly. Ooh, Flamethrower. That's a good one. That's really good. Now we should be able to... Let me actually see if I'm headed the right direction. Yep, I think this is where I want to go. Cross this path. Step inside the dreaded den. There he is, waiting at the gate. At the cave entrance. Hey, Kieran. Uh, did you see the Shrek? There it is, the Dreaded Den. It's supposed to be at the Ogre's home. I've come here many times. I've never seen it. Maybe a powerful Ogre will only show if it heard some kind of battle going on. Yeah, let's battle. Okay, let's do it. Let's see if you've actually improved or if you're still kind of weak. I've got uh, my Quilava. Quilava's going to be a Pokemon I'm going to use here. But yeah, I've got this. Right, 
let's see here. Let's see how well Kieran has improved. Oh, he's got a ferret now. Well, that's that's new. Still have my uh, Quilava. So I'm going to put up a good fight. What level is your ferret? It's Mount Charcoal. I'm good for it. Well, I'm going to find um, Flamethrower. Okay. That happened. That happened. That happened. Okay. Well, that's okay. That's okay. Listen, listen. Listen, listen, friend. We're going to go ahead. I'm going to heal up Krakatoa because I'm not letting Krakatoa not get any experience out of this whole um, thing. Now. Got a max revive. Just throw it to him. Hey. Better be a good Pokemon eventually, Krakatoa. Oh, yeah, so Kieran has actually improved his game. He has actually improved his game. And Nisha, he's got plus four special defense. Now, that just shows that he has improved his game. Alright, boost my electric moves. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. All right, that was a crit. No, that was just powered through. I just powered through. I'm staying in. I'm going to Thunderbolt this Yanma. But yeah, Amnesia. Wow. Actually has some good tech. Some good tech. But, you know, Yanma's not going to stand up to a Thunderbolt. So it goes down pretty easy. It did so much damage, it did do a lot of damage. <clears throat> but now... There we go. Polyworld. Frog versus frog! This is the match of a lifetime. Look at this. Frog versus frog. Polyworld versus squishy. There we go. Thunderbolt. Frog versus frog. And, you know, of course, the electric frog is going to beat out against the water frog. Nice. All right. Sorry, Kieran. But you were defeated. And that probably means that the ogre would want to join my team, just saying, rather than your team. How am I ever going to be able to beat you? If the ogre saw it battle, it would be thinking, wow, that kid's got real strength. My school, Blueberry Academy. It's a school that specializes in teaching in the art of Pokemon battling. If I was strong as you, maybe I could aim to be the best trainer there. Let's go look at the den. Okay. Well. Something's behind the rock. What is that? Who is it? What is that? It's a foot. It's a Deku shrub. It's like we're playing Legend of Zelda now. Watch your head. Not really much to that cave, is there? How dark it is and cramped. And the floor is rough and uneven. Uh, it's a cave. That's how caves are. <clears throat> Poor ogre. Uh, let's play a room of our house. I'd let it stay with us. You're a sweet kid. No, I'm not. I'm just, you know, like the stories about the ogre. That's all. Uh, the whole town would freak out about it. Ah, uh, well. It's an ogre. They've probably never watched Shrek. Sun's already gone down. Guess what? Hey, we've got Flash on our phone. We're going to get that picture. Let's go together. It does sound fun. I'm going to say it does sound fun. I could show you to it. Yeah, that'd be great. Gotta get ready. Gotta swing by the house before heading to the festival. It's in the northwest corner of the village. I can draw a map. Your Rotom foam has a map. Point. Which one is it? Yeah, having phones are pretty handy. 
Having GPS is handy as well. But, yeah, now what we're going to do is we're going to... Let's head back to the town. Alright, huh? I could probably float down. Right? That's that's what I could probably do. Just find it. Ooh. It does look like a... So, a maw just means mouth. And look, it looks like teeth up here. That does look like a t mouth. What we could do is we could just kind of float. And you could see right there is the town. Right there is the town. And I'm like descending quicker than I thought I would. I don't want the item. A super potion. Ooh, there's some items over here. Special attack. Pokeball. Bellsprout vine. Apple and juice. Tart apple. Mmm. Paralyzed heal. There's Volbeats up here. Illuminese. That's Illuminese, isn't it? I don't want to fight you. You're not anything to me. That's one of the weakest bug types. There's some good items up here. I would like to grab Hearthstone. I would like, and this is what I would really like. I would like the item because I do know there's a new Applin evolution. I want the item for that, and I don't know what that exactly is. Sweet Apple, I know is for Appleton. Tart Apple, yeah, uh, Tart Apple, Flapple. That's a good. One. What would be the one for... I have a feeling it would be in this patch of, you know, apples. If I were to find it. Tart. We're seeing a lot of tart apples. Bug bite's good. That's a good move. Ultra ball. Yeah, it would be in this patch of trees. Another tart apple. There's a lot of tart apples. Where did I find the sweet apple? I found that somewhere else, didn't I? Oh. Don't mind me. Oh, that Ekans is freaking out. Ekans is freaking out, seeing me jump around. Sweet apple. Yeah, so you can find those as well. Sweet apples, tart apples. Do they not have the other one here? Or the whatever uh, apple and juice. That's for like item crafting. They don't have whatever. Maybe it's like a specific area, right? Maybe up here is more of your tart apples. Down below is your sweet apple. No, because that's sweet apple too. Maybe those two are the only ones here. So maybe you have to go somewhere else for the uh, new apple. Not syrupy. Sir I think I think syrupy apple is what it what it use. If I recall correctly, I don't know where you get that though. So let's head back into town. He said northwest, correct? So we're going to go to the northwest. Looks real good on you. I love dressing up in my Jinbai. Just like that. Okay, never mind. I'm just going to go up here. Ooh, and there's an item back here, too. Don't mind if I do. Rock Tomb. That's a pretty cool move. That's a cool move. Rock Tomb is always a good move. It's just, you know, the accuracy is probably the biggest downside, but it's a good move. Welcome home, Karen. And who is this with you? Mr. Chabry, he's part of the same school trip as me and C.S. So, this new friend of yours, eh, hey, Karen? I sure am, I guess. I don't know. I've just met him, like, what, today? What, really? We're friends? I feel tingly funny hearing that. <laughs> 
Thank you for befriending our Karen here, Mr. Chabry. Oh, Karen's made a friend? Yeah. Yeah, so I guess he, he kind of doesn't get out much, I guess. They're happy that he's actually socializing. Oh, the festival mask starts tonight, doesn't it? Get some jimbais. Ooh, we're gonna be all fancy for this ceremony. Don't don't throw away my uh, beanie. I like my beanie. I like my beanie. All right. So ooh, it's all teal. So I actually don't have to wear orange. I can wear teal. That's pretty cool. All right, stylish and young man. The teal style card. Ooh. And she's got blueberry stuff still. Alright, so we're going to go to the Festival of Masks. What are you doing back here? Alright, Gran. Couldn't find the mask for the festival. It should be in the shed. It shouldn't be locked. You three can go have rummage. Ooh, we get to pick a mask? Wait, no. There's th only three of them. I want to make a choice. I want to have a choice in this. Maybe they decide, hey, since Mr. Chabry's new to this ceremony, he gets to pick. I want to pick a mask. Let me pick, guys. You get to pick your masks every year. This is my only time I get to do this ceremony. Mr. Chabry's here. Now just rolling up like you own the place. Oh, they told me I could. Are you not paying attention? Guess you have to do without a mask. First come, first serve. Seriously? I doubt. I call cap on what you're saying. Come on, don't look glum. How about instead of a mask, I give you a battle in style. Festival style. Alright, um... I was actually wanting to pick a mask, but I guess there's only two, and they've picked out the masks? I don't know. They get to pick a mask. All right, Carmine. Let's see if you've evolved yours. More Pico. Well, that's 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 actually a, a better choice than before. But still, be dazzled about how great I look in my Jimbai. I'll win while you're distracted. No, I doubt that. I'm actually going to go into my Mr. Fluffball. We haven't used Mr. Fluffball in a while. We really haven't. So I want to go into Mr. Fluffball. It resists both stabs from Morpico, just because Morpico is electric and dark, and it changes its special move depending on its type. So Aura Will is electric, and then sometimes it's dark. And its ability is hangry, so it's going to turn dark mode here. And a flower trick should do the job. It still does quite a bit of damage, even though it's not very effective. Now, Mr. Fluffball, we used to use that a lot. Get a crit there, too, which... I think that move always crits. It's been a while since we've used it. Uh, don't get smug because you scored a critical hit. I'm not panicking or anything. Ah, oh, you have a sash. Okay, okay. If I had something like Sucker Punch, that would be good. Oh, and it and it actually ate something to change back. I think in Sword and Shield, it just changes back. It doesn't actually do anything like that, but it actually eats like something just to change back into its non-hangry form. And it has like an actual animation for when it's switching, not just oh, it's it's, it's a different type now. It actually change. It has a little animation where it realizes it's changing. Forms. I think that's actually kind of cool. Alright, nothing goes down. That's actually cool. They've they've really bumped up more Pico's style points here. Oh, Swadloon. Now, listen, Krakatoa, if you can't handle Swadloon, I'm sorry, but uh, that's on you. Swadloon, Bug Grass, it doesn't have much that it can really do, and battle so if we don't one-shot it i'm gonna be really sad it might have a sash though 
she seems like she is really uh liking her sash strategy all right uh, it's gonna be one shot and look quilava has its flames out it has its flames out this is the biggest change from previous generations I think that just makes it so much cooler. Sinis what is that? Sinis Sha? What was it before? It was that is that that's a different, right? It's different. It's different now. So we're gonna flamethrower. We should be oh we're gonna hit stun for. Okay. I think that's the evolved form. I do believe that's the evolved form. You have the fire weakening berry, don't you? Oh, you do. Oh. Okay. I see you. I see you. We do get the burn, which is nice, but you have the Oka Berry. And the Oka Berry weakens super effective fire type moves. And my question to you is are you a special attacker or physical attacker? Time for a special move. What is the special move? I, I don't know. Shadow Ball. Okay, so you are a special attacker. And that hurts quite a bit. If I can power through, I will probably finish this thing off. Boom! Krakatoa coming in. Mighty Anna. Alright, so fine. Mighty Anna. Um, man, Paulina, I really want you to evolve. Really want you to evolve. Um... We'll go ahead and go into Mighty Inna. Just go into Geoffrey and Hyper Voice. I know, I know, type wise, we have a disadvantage, but I think Geoffrey should be fine. I think it should be fine. Typing wise, I don't really have anything great. Oh, she's angry. I'm going to crush you and go to the festival feeling like a winner. I made her mad. I actually made her mad. Sorry, lady. The attack fell. And you know what? Go ahead and Sucker Punch. I want you to Sucker Punch. I've got the ability that prevents Sucker Punch. Oh, I don't even matter. Don't even matter. Oh, look at that. Level 52. You're supposed to be enamored and distracted by my festival style. The only difference is you're wearing blue. Alright, I think... I think we'll go ahead and let Krakatoa evolve here. This is actually a good place for it to evolve. Look at that. Watch this. It's, gonna... it's Typhlosion now. It's Typhlosion time. Krakatoa is now a Typhlosion. Love Typhlosion. It's one of my favorite. It's my favorite Pokemon. Love Typhlosion. We have a Typhlosion for this chapter of the game. Well, it's not like beating me was going to make another mask appear. Now then, let me get my mask. She's laughing about it. <clears throat> Alright, so she has like a blue monkey and then he has the... It's okay, you can wear my mask. What? No, I said first come, first served. Size, that's your ogre mask. You've always loved that mask best. Yeah, but no buts about Mr. Haber. Get his own in the in the festival. That's fine. No. Let's go. Alright. Sorry, Mr. Chabry. This is, seems harsh, but she's not that bad at all. She's tearing up. She was tearing the shred apart. I'm trying to find the third mask before you got there, but don't tell her I told you that. But I guess she wants to seem like she doesn't care. It's kind of like, oh, I don't care. But she does. Uh, let's go to Kitakami Hall. Let's go. Alright, so wait, am I there? No. Pokedex has been updated. Alright. And I want to heal up, too. Just because, you know. My Pokemon's getting, been taking kind of a beating. I'd like to heal my Pokemon. Thank you very much. That Typhlosion is going to get some usage now. Mm, 
let me actually... There was a sneeze that just hit me out of nowhere. Alright. Typhlosion, you can learn Aerial Ace. You can learn Brick Break. Bulldoze. Dig. That dig's not that bad. Earth Power should... That Typhlosion should totally learn that move. Earth Power. It makes sense. It makes sense. Some fire type moves, which are pretty good moves. Fling. Focus Blast is good. Um, Heat Wave. Helping Hand. Hyper Beam. Low Kick. Um, Overheat is a good move. Reversal. Rock Tomb. Um, you can learn Shadow Claw. That might actually come in handy. Actually, yeah. Go ahead, learn it. You have... Oh no, your attack is lowered. Never mind. Don't give any physical attacks to you. you sh yeah, Swift is good. It gives... Um, gives coverage. Zen Headbutt. I don't think you used to be able to learn Zen Headbutt, so... Now, Kitakami Hall is where we need to go. I should be able to fly there. I've been there before. Yeah, here we go. We're just gonna fly there. And once we fly up there, oh look, Noctowls are flying us around instead of the uh, little parrot fellows. But anyway, here we are, ready for this festival. And we're going to attend the festival in the next episode. If you like this, give it a thumbs up, subscribe. I'll see you in the next Pokemon video.